friends and family, it's your boy Mike and your girl Bree. Hey, and we back in this thing. We back in this thing. We back in this thing, man. I'm telling you, it's been a while, but we about to have them videos coming like that. So we wanted to come back. We just got done watching The Witcher. We did a trailer reaction a few months back. So now we finally watched the whole season and we here to talk about it. And shout out to only one of our subscribers, Kareem, yeah. for yeah. asking us to do the whole trailer thing. Right, and that made us interested in yes. watching it so when it came then, out on Netflix. When it first came on Netflix, we, you know, I was just scrolling through what's trending or what's popular on Netflix, right. and <gasps> The Witcher popped it's up. So then we was like, oh, let's check this out and really see if it's good. Like, we thought it was going right. to be in the trailer reaction we did. Mm -hmm. So, without further ado... It was the bomb. It was so good. It was real good. Um, because for one, it gave us that Game of Thrones vibe yeah, for sure. Definitely. With each one of it was like each one of the episodes had like a different symbol type thing. Mm -hmm. And then it was kind of like towards the end. I like the way they did the show because I feel like each episode explained. It's like they kind of threw you in there at first. Mm -hmm. And then I feel like each episode after that kind of explained how they got to that point. Yeah. And then it was like, okay, now everything is coming together yes. towards the end of the season. Now, so that was great. I was, I did get confused in between Definitely. some of it. Because I was like, hold up, they went back in time. Right. They in the future. I thought this person What's was dead. On? Yeah, I thought that person was dead. Yeah. They really alive right now. Right. So what was really going on? But they did a good job of tying it all back. Man, Definitely. for a Netflix Great show, job. they doing the thing, bro. They really are. Like, really. Like, this was it is really HBO good. type quality to me. And you know what vibe it kind of gave me, too? Sorry okay. to cut you off. But, um, you know, I cannot remember the name of, I want to say it was called The Last King. That was on Netflix also. Yeah, with uh, Uchi. Yes. Uchi. And yeah. it kind of gave, yeah. gave me that vibe a little vibe bit, too. too. It definitely um, did. But, but it was good. Like, it's a good, solid show. Like, if you are... A Game of Thrones. Right, if you are a Game of Thrones type of person, type interested thing. in magic, magic kind of thing, then you would love this show. Um, but when I say vibes, like, <laughs> uh, Game of Thrones vibes... <laughs> For real. If you ain't watched this, hey, it's about to be some stuff. A couple of spoilers. But anyway... <laughs> <laughs> now you've been warned, but anyway, they had dragons in this joint. Yeah, Game of Thrones. Mm -hmm. They had the whole wolf type. Yeah, thing, well, they like have Jon like the Snow. symbol. Yeah, yeah. Kind of like the symbol, symbol kind of thing. So and he had white hair, mm -hmm. like yeah, uh, like Daenerys. Yes. So it yeah. might be her brother. Maybe the vibe. You know, you know them you because know, uh, what is <laughs> Conspiracy. it? Yeah, the theory, movie theories and stuff. Yeah. Somebody <laughs> might try to link that together yeah. for real. But and I it could it, be linked with all it, the magic. Maybe and stuff. who knows? But I think the show overall was so good. Like the acting was good. The way they did the storyline, like I said. Um, like it was so good. It was this a great right show. Here stayed I up was drawn into it. it. Like I was like, dozing off because it was getting late <laughs> night, and I'm usually the one that stayed up, but yeah. she was the one that was still up. The first into episode it. was, I said in the beginning though, the first Maybe, episode yeah. it was a little slow. After he killed, ooh, another spoiler, dang. After he killed, you'll see what he kills, but he killed something, and after he kills that. It was like a good start, and then it was like slow. And then I was like, you know what? Let me start paying attention to the show because it seems like there's a lot of little details. What drew me in to. is basically his, I guess it would be kind of considered his second fight scene. Mm -hmm. When he was doing all that stuff with that sword and all mm -hmm. that, yeah, that really drew me in. But one downfall I feel like from the show that I got was it wasn't a lot of fighting. Like, it wasn't a lot of one on one comeback, I feel like. Like, mm -hmm. you might get one episode, all right, they're going to do a little fighting. Mm -hmm. Next episode, it might just be all talking. Mm -hmm. Then the third episode, it might be a little more fighting, a little less talking. But it was... But I feel like, in the same aspect, I feel like that's why it gave you Game of Thrones vibes at the same time. You smart. 
Because yeah. Game of Thrones yeah. was kind of like that too. Every time. They didn't yeah. fight all the time. Yeah. You had some. You had two or three episodes sometimes when <laughs> nobody fought. Yeah, right. They were literally talking through the entire episode. So I mean, I they don't take was, nothing from oh, the storyline at all. It's great. I just feel like it could have been I, a little, I wish I a little saw, bit more fighting. I think to really show kind of what he does. I would have liked to see a little more monster fighting, but yeah, because I think it's supposed to be in a little more background of exactly what he is. I think. Well, that might come. I, I hope they yeah. doing other seasons because right. we need oh, two, yeah, three, definitely. four, five, six, yeah. seven, eight seasons. Song. Right. Because they kind of started to show his past. Towards the end of the right, season, right, right, to kind of explain yeah, a little bit, yeah, a little bit. But I guess they couldn't give us a lot, and the way they cut it off was some bulls. And I don't know how long we gotta wait for season two, but that was messed up how they cut us but off. But I can say that. this though, they could have. It could have been one of those situations. It could have been one of those situations though that although him and that girl was supposed to meet or whatever, they could have dragged it out a really long time oh, too. Yeah, they could so at the same it. time yeah. to make it one of those things where it's like this whole season, they're trying to find each other, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? And they're going through their own, you know, trials, I guess, as they go mm-hmm. to make that almost, to make that the last scene, I think was a great ending to the season. It made it like, dang, what's going to happen next? Mm-hmm. But I think it was a great end because you know the whole season they went and they could have made it where like dragging on and on and on and if anybody can y'all drop some down in the comments please and let us know when his eyes turn black what reason is it i know i've seen i've noticed that when he takes like some type of potion thing it turns his eyes black but did he take a potion that night where he was fighting them things that came out the ground though his eyes turned black that night remember i don't remember if he did take anything so yeah like i wonder if it's one of those things that like when he gets we thought when he got angry right i'm interested though somebody know know, drop it down below because i know it's some of y'all out here that know way Way more more about this whole witcher thing than we did yeah i I, I ain't even gonna lie we ain't (laughs) know about no witcher at all until somebody you know one of the recommended us to watch shout out to you again for that definitely but that's all I got on this with you. Great show. Please Great go show. check it out. Go watch. Like if you need something to watch right now, go check it out. And you into the medieval Game of Thrones, Lord Kinda of the Rings, feels, yeah. Harry Potter magic vibes. <laughs> this is for you, for real, for real. Definitely. So Definitely. without further ado, please like, comment, and subscribe on the video. Please. And it's been your boy Mike. And your girl Bree. Hey, and we out.